Hey y'all, Yuritsa here. I'm super excited because a brand new witchy subscription box uh, started up in November. It is called Witchcraft Way. Um, I signed up for it like as soon as it became available. It shipped on the 1st and got here on the 4th, um, which was yesterday for me. Uh, it was just late and I didn't have good enough lighting to film it. And I know it's still not great, but we work with what we have. Um, super excited. It is about $50. Um, I have no idea what to expect. I have avoided all spoilers and yeah, I'm super excited. It does come in this box. Um, there is no like outer packaging on it. Ah. All right, so this is the view I'm getting when I open it. I'm going to set this spoiler sheet to the side. I'm not wearing my glasses because they like reflect weirdly, which is good because it means I cannot, I can't, I can't make out what any of that says right now. Oh, okay. So this is on top. It says cottage craft, magic and ritual for home and hearth, Sylvia Dressel House. Um, let's see. Contents. What is green witchcraft and an introduction? Two, a pagan house blessing chant. Three, herbs and plants for home magic. Five, a spell to make a home cozier. Oh, these are the page numbers. <laughs> page seven, the magic of besoms. Nine, making your own besom. Um, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but it's another word for a broom, basically. Um, a blessed stovetop potpourri, getting rid of insects, the green witch way. House cleaning magic, a collection of cottages, examples of home magic green witch, crystal witch, cosmic witch, sea witch, kitchen witch, and witches banishing salt bowl. Cute. So, got some nice pictures and stuff. Um, it's got like a scent to it because of the stuff in the box, I guess. But oh yeah, super cute it is. Let's see. These last few pages aren't numbered. So, actually are any of them numbered? No, there are no numbers on the pages, so I don't know what the point of a table of contents with numbers on them is for if you have to like physically count the numbers. So that's kind of weird. Yeah, there's there's no page numbers anywhere, <laughs> um, but it's at least 24 pages, I guess. Um, cool. I'm excited to look at that. It's nice and tiny and cute. Um, awesome. And I'm definitely like in fall time excited to do some house magic. Let's um, the witchcraft ticket to magic 15% um, off code exclusive to subscribers so I won't share that code because I don't want to yeah like I don't want to be rude to the creators but there's one in here for Blossom and Burr, whatever that is, Sea Witch Botanicals, and Rituals Incense. So there's three 15% off coupons in here um, for me to use if I want. This is what it looks like now. I'm excited. There's a lot more goodies in here than I thought considering the size of the box. So let's see. Oh, let me take this out of the plastic. Bleep. Plant Ally Talismans in this little like brown paper bag um quantity 10. so it's got these little business card shaped things let's see i'm probably gonna butcher the pronunciations but i've got borage oh cute and then on the back it's got a little thing about it uh for sojourns as quick as a nip of whiskey and as long as endless lifetimes. Harness your inner warrior, cloaked in courage, protection, psychic powers, and get to work. Cute. So it's got that little thing on the back. I won't read all of them. Uh, calendula. Chamomile. Hyssop. Lavender. Mugwort. Mullein. Mullein? Mullein? I have no idea. 
rosemary, sagebrush, and yarrow. Cute. Um, not sure how I will put them to use. I'm wondering if the cheat sheet has any more info, but I will definitely figure out something if nothing else. So those are little plant allies. Uh, let's see. Got some dragon's blood incense cones. There's quite a few. I want to say maybe like 10 of them. Quite a number of them. Awesome. I love dragon's blood, so that's cool. Alright, then we've got some kind of candle. Uh, Labradorite Transformation Rosemary Hand Poured by Annabella Crystals, I guess. Arabella, Arabella Crystals. Um, let's see. It's got that nice coloring. It smells okay. I feel like there's a lot of scented stuff in the box, so it's hard to differentiate. Nice though, I always love me some candles. Ooh. I'm really having to squint hard to read these, so I don't know what that is yet. I'm imagining maybe tea or an herb. Yeah, tea, the Witchwood Tea House. Priestess, awaken your inner priestess. Ingredients, lemon balm, yarrow, rose, chamomile, kava, cinnamon, dandelion, and mugwort. Oh, it's got this cute little seal on it. I love purple. Oh, I don't wanna break it quite yet, but you can see it's pretty, pretty full. Definitely get quite a few cups out of that. Awesome. Uh, let's see, got a couple things left in here. Let's do. Oh, I think it says truth oil. Yeah. I thought it was a candle at first. Um, let's see. Thistle and rose shop. Spiritual shop. Uh, energies. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, truth oil. Anointing oil. Bulgarian lavender. Fern needle. Calendula petals. Set into pure olive oil for drams. Yes, it's a rolly top. I love these. So you can get just a little bit. You could like roll it on yourself or onto a thing. It smells really nice. That's awesome. Ooh, I'm very excited about that. I don't have a lot of rolly top oils, but that's probably my, my favorite for certain types um you know obviously if i want to use it to anoint like a candle like a glass candle i can't do that so much the droppers are better for that but for like wearing it and stuff super cool so there's that truth oil and then i think there's just the one last thing yeah Let's see next coat looks like a pendant <laughs> let me pull it up yeah so just on a chain with a little bead at the end there. Really short chain, which is nice. Got this beautiful black stone. Bloop. Awesome. Um, so let's see if I have anything special to say about any of these. Um, yeah, not really a lot of info, just um the Instagram accounts of the people who made these items as well as their like normal sale value. <coughs> so, oh, I was just looking for my phone, which is right here, um, cause I can't do math. Cool, so according to the dollar values on here, it's a total of $62 value. Um, so a little bit more than the box itself, which again is $50. Um, and then it looks like there is something else on the back here. Um, the Witchcraft Way spell pages, home cleansing besom spell, materials and tools, juniper cleansing wand or loose juniper incense and besom. Ritual, light the juniper cleansing wand or loose incense at your altar and meditate with and set your intention into your besom. 
starting at the highest and or northwestern part of your house, sweep each room working backwards towards the door from the furthest point of the room. As you sweep, chant the following, Besom, be Besom, sacred broom, hear me and cleanse this room. I dispel all negativity and pain, only good and light remain. The front, of your, the front room of your home should be last. When you come to your front door, sweep three times at your threshold, then with gusto, take one final sweep backward vigorously as you say, my home is clear and free, all energy is pure, so mote it be. Cute. I like it. It's a good first box. Um, yeah. I'm, there's nothing I'm not a fan of, so that's cool. Um, the value is, is pretty decent. Um, a nice little like mix of items, and yeah, I'm super excited about it. So quick review, we've got this little besom spell candle roll on truth oil that smells amazing the little plant ally cards which i'm sure i'll find some ritual use for uh dragon's blood incense a nice little tea um oh this is obsidian that's the one thing i learned from the sheet so an obsidian pendant a cute little mini book um with lots of home based magic which i'm very excited for and three 15 percent off coupons that i probably won't use but maybe we'll, we'll see i spend so much money on these types of boxes uh, i can't justify extra purchases um yeah um i'm pretty happy with this as a first box um definitely gonna keep the subscription for december just to keep it rolling for a little bit um i don't know if it will remain on my list of like must-haves like the witch casket boxes um it's just too early to tell really not because of anything bad it's just you know 50 dollars is not an insignificant amount of money so i gotta be a little bit choosy when it comes to my boxes so yeah that's it i'm excited i'm pretty happy with it um nice good start nothing appropriative nothing problematic so like that already puts it above a lot of other boxes um out there and yeah i'm excited i hope you guys are too uh, again it's called the witchcraft way so check them out if you feel like it um and i will see you guys next time